I mean, in many respects, John, it was a golden age, wasn't it, for Scottish football, certainly in European terms as well. But, but domestically, at least, you were just a bit in the shadow of Celtic at that time, weren't you? I'm glad you brought that up. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Celtic had the great, um, the great run with the Lisbon mm. Lions, and it was, it was coming to an end by the time 72 came along. Mm. Uh, it also coincided with the fact that Willie Ward, one of our ex-players, came back to the club as manager and uh, basically lifted us up from the, the gutter, so to speak, to compete again at that level. But we have to admit, Celtic had a great side then and it took a, a lot of hard work and um, eventually uh, we got the players, players on our side that could overcome that. And uh, basically from then on, for most of the 70s, we had a very successful mm. time. But what were relationships like between the players, between Celtic and Rangers players, Derek? Well, I got on well. I mean, I was very friendly with uh, with Danny McGrain and with Kenny Dalglish as well. You know, we, we did things together, you know, like shop openings or whatever. In Glasgow, one can't do it without the other. So if Danny was asked somewhere, they would ask me and, and Kenny was the same. But yeah, we got on well. I mean, we didn't go out drinking and enjoying ourselves together, but we enjoyed each other's company. Mm. Uh, I mean, of course... You played in that 1967 uh, final, didn't you, Sandy? I know you yeah. did it, uh, as well, John. But I just wonder how difficult was that coming... I think it was a week after, wasn't it? It was a week after Celtic had uh, won in Lisbon. How, yeah. how difficult was that for you? To be honest, I, I was only an 18-year-old kid, so I was, it was my first ever cup final. So you're, you're playing in the first team, which you're, you're just absolutely delighted with. But to play your first ever cup final to be a European cup final was uh, just a wee bit special. And... To be honest, I was too young to take it in. Mm. I was just happy to be there. Uh, and I know after the game we were... To be honest, I've seen the, a video of that game uh, about a year ago and uh, we absolutely wiped the floor with Bairn, but we couldn't score the goal. Uh, and I remember that while I wasn't too unhappy at the end of the game, I, I know that John and some of the older players were a wee bit... They, were, they took it really, really bad. But uh, to be honest, I, as I say, I was just happy to play there. And I didn't understand the... The consequences, the Celtic winning a European trophy and us not. And that's when we did get the chance to win it in 72. It was that wee bit sweeter to, mm. if you like, level it up. Mm. I mean, did, did you feel under pressure to deliver something, John? Yeah, I, I, I was really disappointed in 67 because mm. we were unlucky enough to play Bayern Munich uh, in the final in Germany, in Nuremberg. Yeah. Uh, and, and I'll never forget the dressing room was a concrete, a big concrete thing. It was huge. And I walked in. I walked into the dressing room. And I don't know if I don't know if he was wasn't disappointed, but I certainly was. And I slung this box with my medal right against every wall. And the little trainer, who was uh, the second team trainer, who was there, he came up to me in the team bus going back to the hotel, and he says, "Listen, son, you may want to keep that till uh, for the future and look back on it. You know, because you're not, not playing a European final very often." So, to answer your question, yeah, by the time we got to Barcelona in '72, uh, I felt. Well, I had I had been a young player, although I just joined the club when we played Fiorentina in 60, 61. We had lost in, against Bayern Munich in 67. And by this time, I really knew you didn't get many European finals. So I thought Barcelona could possibly be, well, certainly my last throw at the dice. And uh, I felt it was one we had to win. Mm. We just had to win for, for the club and for the supporters as well, mm. as, as well as for ourselves.